just background noise. It's extremely high for that seven or ten, and you're just nearly over, so it's very, very difficult to copy. We've had a tremendous, tremendous rainstorm down here yesterday and last night. I don't know how much rain comes down. I haven't looked at my rain gauge yet, but it'll be in the, uh, certainly in the inches. And a lot of my lot is all flooded. It's only half, and we have four or five inches of rain, and uh, it's really flooded. So we had a lot of it, to say the least. Well, anyway, that's the story from here. Bev, you uh, got that, that you in there? I don't know whether I ain't talking with you or not. The third fight, uh, the one CL, the one CPL. Yeah, you're above the noise level also, but we're going to be right in it. How do you got to be there, North? What's the V3LC? Do you want to be yeah, VE, uh, V1 GPL, V3LC, well, I'm using the little uh, SDR uh, radio uh, kit that I built up over the uh, the week, uh, which runs uh, about one watt, but I got it fed into the uh, uh, the amplifier here, and maybe that boosts it about 10 dB, maybe to 10 watts or so. So uh, I made some contacts actually on sideband on the trans-provincial net just with one watt yesterday. So absolutely amazing uh, this little uh, little radio. So anyway, uh, <laughs> I wonder. Well, I guess you can't hear it too well because it's not too uh, too strong. But I wonder uh, how the audio sounds. How the audio sounds. I'm uh, the the uh, what I'm uh, talking to, of course, is on a computer headset that's plugged into the computer, and and then the computer's plugged into this uh, circuit board. Uh, by USB, and uh, and that's how she works. Uh, uh, over to you there, uh, Bev, uh, V1TL, V3LC. Okay, Norm, well, you're running at 7 to 8 through that time. No, you're above my noise here when I switch to the vertical, the noise dropped down below 5, so. But if I go on my dipole, it's around 6 and 7 there. The noise is terrible here. It's atmospheric, and uh, it's all it is. But you've got a good signal here this morning, John, for 10 months. Or, <laughs> you're doing really well. You're doing really well. And the voice sounds like it always does, so uh, I wouldn't touch anything uh, audio-wise. You're doing a good job, as far as I can see. At least I can't find any problem with it, that's for sure. i got a question for you, though, Mark. Where did they move uh, the transprovincial net to? Because I used to listen on it 55 in the morning, but uh, I don't know if it's still there or not. I don't hear anything. Okay, Jerry, very good. Well, thank you very much for the uh, the compliments on the little radio here. And, uh, uh, well, you know, <laughs> audio is all a matter of, uh, I guess, how they shape the bandpass and things like that, because this uh, headset I'm using is a is an El Cheapo uh, headset, you know, that uh, I sometimes use on the computer for Skype and things like that. So anyway, actually I'm taking a little video of, uh, of this uh, QSO, and I'm going to uh, post it up onto uh, YouTube uh, 
and uh, maybe some uh, some of the uh, old work colleagues can tune in on, on it and uh, hear your voice there, Jerry, so that'll be uh, kind of interesting. Anyway, um, I'm going to shut down the camera now and, uh, and concentrate on a real activity here, but uh, good for the signal report and uh, um, I, uh, I'm glad I was able to uh, make contact uh, this morning uh, using the new, uh, the new technology. All I need is a little bit more power and we'll be in business. Uh, V1TL uh, and uh, uh, there's an, uh, uh, another station, uh, I guess V1VI, I'm not, not familiar with you sir. Um, I'm Norm V3 Lima Charlie and I'm in Ottawa. V3LC, over to you there Bev.